with the wind settling down tonight. Temperatures keep on falling uh, through the evening. Gusty wind expected still uh, jumping up to 35 to 40 miles per hour. But by morning, that'll be closer to 15 to 20 miles per hour and temperatures are dropping to around 40. Now through the day tomorrow, I am expecting dry weather. In fact, dry weather is going to stick around not only tomorrow, but into tomorrow night, right on into Thursday morning, which is going to be a cold start right around 32 degrees here out the door Thursday and then dry weather continues on Thursday. A few more clouds up in the snow belt and even a few showers well to our north, but most of our region stays dry. That will come to an end by Friday morning as the next storm lifts up through our area. We're going to be cold enough Friday morning for some snow showers around and then it warms up through the day. So the snow showers will become rain showers on into the afternoon. The temperature staying chilly though, barely getting back into the low 40s on into the afternoon, then turning much colder into your Friday night. So tonight the gusty wind settling down the risk for showers wrapping up for us this evening, dropping to 39 tomorrow upper 40s dry weather and better weather expected uh, for your day. Uh, still a little breezy at times, but nothing like what we had around today. Going on into Thursday, the dry weather continues. Some cold starts, mid 40s Thursday afternoon, low 40s on Friday. Snow showers early, changing to rain showers, not expecting much snow. A few lake effect snow showers will linger with blustery weather into your Saturday. The best chance of that in the snow belt. Temperatures cold, mid 30s, upper 30s Sunday, but dry. Monday starts dry, but the next storm moving up the east coast will need to be watched. It's going to throw colder temperatures our way, blustery weather, and the chance of snow showers through the middle of next week.